Hi, and welcome to Art Corner this morning. Um, we're going to do something different today, so y'all bear with me. We're going to do a technique that is pretty cool. It's called trompe l'oeil, and the term means, it's French term, which means fool the eye. And it's an artistic um, technique that was used in the early days by Roman muralists and later on by European painters during the Renaissance to create the illusion of something actually being there that is not a window, etc. Today we're going to do a little goldfish in a bag. Uh, it's going to be hanging on a piece of um, a cabinet or a wall, maybe in somebody's house. I'm using a board today instead of a canvas, and I primed it, and I'm going to do a little wood graining to give it some background. So bear with me on this one. We'll see how it goes. I've got my paint in my plate. I'm loosening up my paint so I can do a wash, and then we're going to use a wood graining tool. You can buy these at paint stores, artist stores, and it creates the illusion of some wood grain. So we're going to see if this works. Let me get sort of a, a light wash going so that I can uh, create a little bit of wood graining behind this little fish that's going to be hanging on a wall. I'm lightly putting a little bit of paint on this board. Just doing my strokes very loose up and down. More water than paint, actually. May not even need the wood graining tool, but I think I will. Just aging up this piece of wood, the color I have on it, just a little bit. Okay, now before it dries, get your wood graining tool and you start at the bottom of this piece and you just sort of waller it, just kind of move it back and forth like this and it creates the illusion of a wood grain. And that's working out real well. Let's see, let me wet this part again. Get a little bit more water on it before it dries. And it doesn't really matter where you start and stop because wood's kind of irregular. So you can sort of see it's starting to show a grain on this piece of wood. I did this actually in my home. I had some white painted wood and I wanted it to look wood grainy in my den. So I got a wood stain and I applied it to the painted woodwork and did this graining tool all over it. So it looks like the woodwork in my den is actually raw wood. Now we're going to let this dry a little bit. I'm going to get a paper towel and just sort of skiff up the edges so that we can see our artwork. But you can see the wood grain on this board. Now I'm just softening it up just a little bit so it is not the predominant thing that we'll be looking at. It'll also help it to dry. Can you see the wood grain here coming through, but you still haven't lost your color. Okay. Now, I think it is dry enough to go ahead and start my drawing. It's going to be like a little goldfish you purchased at the fair, and it's going to be in a plastic bag, and we're going to hang him on a nail. So let me start my nail. 